Hey everyone, we are backstage here, and as you know, and so you think you could dance, it's not just about the dancers, it's about the choreographers. So tell us a little bit about yourselves and uh, the performance you guys choreographed tonight. Well, my name is Jonathan. This is my beautiful wife, Oksana. <laughs> yeah. Choreographer duo. Uh, we kind of do the more of the ballroom salsa, uh, but today was uh, the first time we ever got to do a group opening number for So You Think You Can Dance, because we're used to doing the duo pieces, but today we got to do a group number with the top eight, and I think it went incredible. They did yeah, amazing. How, they did amazing. Yeah. How was it different for you guys as choreographers to kind of take on, instead of like a couple, taking on eight dancers and uh, really kick off the show? Well, it's just so much more to do, and also the biggest difference um, from experiences that we had before, usually we have a couple days to work on the duet. Yeah. Uh, for the group number, we had one, one day, day. Oh, wow. and we had eight dancers instead of two, and it was overwhelming and so much to do, but everything came together and uh, couldn't be happier. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Absolutely, so maybe you'll do more of those. <laughs> hey, maybe so, maybe so, we love it. I mean, honestly, I, I think what the, the best thing about it was just everybody's energy on stage. I mean, we didn't have to tell them to do that at all. So like when you heard them screaming, being vocal, and just bringing it all out there, that was all of them, you know? we didn't. That's something you can't ask, ask dancers to do. They have to bring that energy to create these choreographies and make them come to life, and they really did, absolutely did. And each, I mean, you guys have done this before pr prior seasons. What is it about this group that's different? Because obviously, like, each season you get kind of like a different freshman class. What, what do you feel about this eight, or now, unfortunately, six, um, that are much different than maybe past seasons, or what is exciting about them? I think one thing that I definitely saw that's different is they're so supportive of each other. I mean, especially with this group, if, if somebody was getting a little bit tired, you just heard somebody in the background go, don't worry about it, just start yelling and stuff like that. Everybody had each other's backs. Uh, They're helping each other with the steps, like what, when we're learning group pieces and somebody's not getting it, the other members are gonna come over and help them. They make sure they get it as a team because you know they understand. Yeah. Uh, for, for this number to look good, you know they all have to look they good, so, look good, so yeah. they're super supportive of each other. Yeah, I think, I think that's the thing. They're, they're not selfish at all. They, they knew that this group number had to come together as one whole and not just individual dancers. Yeah, well, it worked. It was beautiful. So we can't wait to, obviously, we can't wait for everybody else to see it yeah. when it kicks off the next show. And we're two hours now on yes, Monday. Two, two hours. Yeah. I know. Absolutely. absolutely. And the season finale is coming up soon, obviously, as well, live the 16th. So make sure you're watching So You Think You Can Dance on Fox. Thank you both so much. Thank you.